So let's go ahead now and go to the next story. Speaking of out of control governments, North Korea warns foreigners leave South amid new threats of war to launch missiles tomorrow. What about gun control for the government? What about taking the guns of the government? No, no, no. Oh, they all get their guns, even though government's the most dangerous thing with guns. The poor North Korean people. And now they've got 10,000 artillery pieces plus, that's a conservative estimate, pointed at Seoul from the mountaintops, you know, pointing down 30 miles away in South Korea, threatening to blow it up. And they can probably nuke South Korea uh, or Japan. And, we, and, and our own government, Donald Rumsfeld, gave them the reactors in the mid-90s along with Clinton. Gotta love Clinton. Oh, let's help transfer reactors that can make A-bombs to North Korea so they can threaten World War III, but let's take Alex Jones's guns so I gotta live like they do in Chicago with armed criminals busting down my door and the, and the criminal police throwing the book at good citizens. Tyranny came to America, folks. Obama is going into full bore takeover mode. God help us, ladies and gentlemen. God help us. Continuing here, Amber Alerts, CNN confirms missing family is in Cuba. What do they have alerts for? Veterans who are engineers with no criminal record until they reportedly got caught with half a bowl of marijuana and a tiny pipe. And so a year later, they couldn't get their kids back, so they went and took them back. And now they've run, and oh my gosh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, now they've been called anti-government. Cuba does not recognize U.S. court orders. That means even though the U.S. took child custody away from the family in Cuba official eyes, the uh, family and the boys as parents. That's right. Even the communist regime of Cuba isn't as communist as America is, where we have MSNBC host openly, openly, openly coming out uh, and saying the state controls your kids. You've got to run to Cuba now to get freedom. Now, now again, Cuba's already a tyranny. But in America, you have the old vestiges of liberty left in the free press, but most of it bought off, and then the tyranny growing. And now they're trying to dissolve the old republic. The First Amendment, people being arrested for filming police, you name it. It is just absolutely off the chart. I wish we could have an amber alert for Fast and Furious shipping guns to Mexico. I wish we could have an amber alert for $85 billion a month given to foreign banks. Instead of demonizing, oh my gosh, some parents have their kids back. Oh, it's so horrible. This is the sickening, disgusting authoritarians that we have that have taken control of this country. Unbelievable. Visit InfoWars.com and PrisonPlanet.com. When you're on the site, you can also tune in 24 hours a day to my daily radio broadcast. There's also a free iPhone app to listen to the syndicated radio show when and where you want.